Hi Aquarius, this is going to be your love and general reading for September 16th through the end of September. Aquarius Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus Sun. What's going on Aquarius? Aquarius that are going to be watching this to come out is the fool in the reverse and the tower in the reverse okay so right off the bat you are dodging a bullet Aquarius okay you are dodging a bullet is the one thing I want to say here um, you know the fool in the reverse you are thinking very smart and very logically about a certain situation here and you're just not going to hop into anything okay you are not going to let lust or you know, just the heat of the moment has um, get to you, okay? And with the tower in the reverse, you're letting something fall, or you're just, you're just uh, avoiding something. You're avoiding a situation that you know if you do not take cautious steps towards, it could blow up in your face, okay? Okay. We have Aries energy, we have Scorpio energy here, okay? The Fool in the Tower could also be Aquarius. Queen of Cups, okay? So we have a character here. We have a Cancer Pisces Scorpio, but let me tell you, in this deck, they did the Queen of the Queen of Cups so dirty in this deck. Like, look how horrible she looks. She's fucking crying. She's sobbing, dude. They did her so dirty. <laughs> but anyways, there may be a Cancer Pisces Scorpio individual that's around you, or this could be the... Um, element that you are embodying Aquarius where you are not hopping into anything you are not trying to um, initiate any drama or any destruction but you're trying to come from an understanding point of view you're trying to come from a loving point of view in this situation I feel like it's very easy for you to start drama in whatever situation this is but you're really getting a hold of your emotions okay and you're trying to think about what's the best thing to do for everyone, okay? I'm actually surprised the Queen of Swords didn't come out, but we have the Queen of Cups, so you're not going to be super cutthroat, but I feel like you're just, you have every, you're just trying to come from a loving standpoint here. You're not trying to be too rigid, you're just trying to be understanding, okay? You could also have a um, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio in your chart. Wow, the Ace of Swords at the bottom of the deck. So, um, with doing this, Aquarius, you know you hold a lot of power. You know you could handle this situation in a negative way, and you know you can handle this situation in a very good way, okay? So, with great power comes great responsibility, right? 
You could also be avoiding a tower moment with a Cancer individual. If you are dealing with a Cancer, um, they're showing up in the upright, so that's good. They're showing up upright. Um, they're being very loving towards you. They're trying to be very understanding towards you, Aquarius. Um, and they're also trying to avoid drama. Okay? They're also trying to avoid drama. This Queen of Cups here, they love you or they have a crush on you. And there, may, there could have already been some sort of a tower moment with this person too. They're like, look, look how she's looking. She looks tired. They did her so dirty in this deck dude. But she looks tired. She looks frustrated. Like she, she just had enough dude. Like. Um, the Hanged Man, wow. This could be a Pisces, or you have Pisces in your chart. Um, you're starting to look at this situation from a different perspective here. This situation could have even sparked some type of spiritual awakening, Kundalini awakening within you as well, or within the other person. You could be dealing with an Aries Pisces, or you have Aquarius Aries Pisces in your chart here. But with the Hanged Man also, um, you are not going to rush into anything. We have the Hanged Man rooted down by the Fool, so it's like, you are taking your time. You are letting the answers come to you, or even though you may just know Aquarius, you're just trying to find the spiritual aspect in this situation, okay? We have the Ace of Wands in the reverse. So, I feel like there's an offer here that is being rejected. Okay, an offer here that's being turned down, or either someone here is just not taking up the offer, okay? swords in the reverse so I feel like there's a queen of cups we have the queen of cups rooted down by the six of swords reverse this queen of cups is kind of or is living in the past they're having a trouble they're having trouble releasing the past or just getting over the situation here okay it has made them very very emotional is what I'm saying but they're showing up in the upright the Queen of Cups upright is beautiful, that's great. The Queen of Cups in reverse is scary, okay? So I'm happy she's showing up in the upright. But we do have the Ace of Pentacles here, okay? So there is some type of offer here or a new start. So we have the Ace of Pentacles, wow. The Ace of Pentacles upright, the Nine of Cups reverse, Queen of Wands upright, and the Ace of Chalices in the reverse. There is an offer being rejected here, but Aquarius, I feel like you are just going to very easily step into your Queen of Wands energy, where you're just confident, you know your worth, and even though an offer got turned down, it's like, you know your worth, man, you're not going to trip too hard about it. Yeah, you're going to be a little emotional, like that sucks, but it's like you, you know, you're okay, is what I'm getting here. You're going to be okay. And you know it too. Yeah, we have the, yeah, look at that. The two of wands, 
strength upright and justice in the reverse. So there's some type of injustice here, but you're staying strong. You're not going to let this situation get to you. And with the two of wands here, you have goals, opportunities, new starts that you're um, very much more interested in than just an offer being turned down here, okay? That's what I'm getting. Yeah, so Aquarius, I'm just seeing like a situation here where there may have been some deception, injustice, but you're handling it very well. And you're trying to see like the spiritual aspect of just what went down here, okay? But you're staying strong. We have Leo, we have Libra, and Pisces, Aries, Scorpio, okay? So that is all I have for you, Aquarius. Take it easy, okay? Bye.